weren't really working together back then, but we are now. Don't worry about it. Um, Asahi, do you remember what Canon ended up talking to you about? Not very clearly, no. He might have said something. Oh, you are useless. I remember. He said something like this. Delusions are one player only. A world just for you. That's what makes a delusion a delusion. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? I thought it was pretty straightforward. I'm not so sure. But he was the Grand Phantasm here as well, right? That's right. Asahi and I took him down. And when we did, the encroachment of the delusion came to a stop. Which means Canon definitely was the Grand Phantasm. Then who the hell spawned him, damn it? I wonder. You look like you're onto something. Ah, uh, well. Somebody's coming! Listen, it's a group of seven, followed by an indeterminate number of maids. Our orders are to capture them on sight. DAB agents, let's destroy them. If we're found out now, we could end up in real trouble. We should try to slip out of here unnoticed. Ugh, fine. I guess that's reasonable. Phew, we made it out. Don't celebrate yet. They're probably in hot pursuit. If we all run together, we'll stick out like a sore thumb. Our group's just too big. Good point. We should split up. Where do you want to reconvene? Uh, Kemi's place has never let us down before. Yeah, seems like a safe spot. If they catch me on my way, they'll wish they hadn't. In your dreams. This is no time to bicker. Run already!
Asaki? Oh, it's you, Asahi. Guess we both made a clean getaway, huh? Yeah, no tails on me as best as I can tell. <sighs> Looks like we're off the hook. <sighs> Saki? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess we are. Are you doing all right? You seem kind of out of it. Did you eat something that didn't agree with you? Uh, hey, why do you always think it's about food with me? It's just... Just what? It's just that it's been a while since we've been able to talk like this. Just the two of us, I mean. Yeah, I guess it has been. You mean just the three of us? I'm here too, you know. Pin Coon, you know you're not supposed to jump out in public like that. Yeah. <laughs> this feels like back when we first met, doesn't it? Yeah, it really does. Back when you pulled me into this whole crazy adventure. I've been a real nuisance. Haven't I? Oh, at first, definitely. Waking up early every morning was the worst. Sorry. What meaningful member of society would consider noon early? Pinkoon. Yeah. <laughs> but now, things are different. Hmm? I'm getting less sleep than ever with everything that's going on, but life is so much more fun than when I was a neat. Not that, you know, I'm not a neat anymore. Yeah. Beat you to it, Pinkoon. Nuts. The point is, meeting you changed me, Saki. Changed so much within me. What's gotten into you? But I guess I could say the same. You're the only reason I've been able to bounce back the way I have, Asahi. When you put it that way, it's kind of embarrassing. Yeah, I guess it is. Um. Uh. Yo, what are you nerds doing out here? Y Yamato? We're literally all waiting on you. So come on in already, will ya? Okay. Huh? Well, something wrong? No, it's nothing. Nothing at all. Let's just head inside, okay? Hmm? You're even later than I thought you'd be. Now, what could have kept two able-bodied young things like yourselves? N nothing Just laziness. And I got lost. Nothing at all. Youth is a wonderful thing. I miss it. I'm just glad everybody's okay. Sure seems like it. Nobody missing any fingers or toes? Not me. By the way, Ihara, what was it you were saying back there? Oh, yeah, that's right. The Sahi. You understood what I was getting at, didn't you? Who, me? Uh, um... I think I may have figured it out. Hey, not bad, little lady. Cannon told us once before that delusions are a recursive mass of potential, right? Oh, yeah, I get it now. You finally figured it out? Um, I think so. Basically, uh... Man, how do I put this into words? Trying not to look stupid is a worse move than admitting you're confused. Allow me to explain. Sorry. I believe we've been operating under a false assumption. That canon is specifically someone's delusion. And that's a key point of contention. The only way everything fits together is if you think about it like this. The existence of the delusion we call canon is perpetuated by the delusion we call canon. He's self-reproducing. That's it in a nutshell. Exactly what I was thinking. So the recursive mass of potential was him.